Nigerian Association of Chambers of Commerce, Industry, Mines and Agriculture, Nasema held its fourth quarter meeting with journalists in Lagos, explaining their concerns and worries over the current situation of the state of our economy. The meeting was presided over by the national president of Nasema, Idejon Udiagwala. It is on record that it's barely two years now when government raised tax education tax from 2% to 2.5%. Many companies are struggling to adjust to that. And now, same is being raised to 3%. Also recall that VAT was also raised from 5% to 7.5% over the same period. These are besides over 50 other forms of taxes and levies being imposed on the organized private sector by both federal, states, and local governments. While going through the general review of the decision statistics from the Nigerian Bureau revealed that our economy continues to downsize from 3.54% GDP to growth in the second quarter of 2022 to 2.25% in the third quarter. In the same vein, the association expressed displeasure with our national greed, inflation, exchange rates, power failure, unemployment and insecurity ravaging our dead nation. Road travels have become too dangerous to undertake because of kidnapping and banditry. And INEC has expressed great concerns and fears on the increasing threat that insecurity poses to the 2023 general election. Nasima calls on the federal government to adequately kit the security agencies with the security gadgets, modern ones, for example, drones and remote armory that is required to execute their constitutional functions of maintaining peace. Nasema, however, urged the members of the public to short vote buyers and vote wisely in the forthcoming general elections. In Lagos, Olayinka, Olatunji reporting for Newsbuster, NGTV. <music>